Horace Mann Daily Challenge. Woo! Woo! Daily Challenge, yeah! Woo! Number six. Hello and welcome to Daily Challenge number six. Are you ready? Let's start to warm up. Let's get these knees going, stepping on the spot, marching, get the arms going as well. Really important. Today's challenge is going to be using a die like this one here. Each side represents a different way of moving. It's important to have a space that's clear so you can work in, that you don't knock into anything. Make sure that you have enough space to be able to move as much as you can. Now, the first exercise, number one on the die, will be a skip. If you're able to do it while moving on a carpet or a rug, you can do that. I'm showing you right now. I'm doing a figure of eight, nice and easy to move around on. You can also do it on the spot. You don't actually have to have more space than where you are standing. And we also have a gallop. I'm doing a gallop around now. One foot leads the other. I've got the reins of my horse, so I'm moving around. Make sure that you have enough space to be able to move. And if there isn't much space, you can always do it on the spot. Whoa, horsey. So if you want need to do this one on the spot, you can. It's a little bit difficult, but you can do it. Here you go, I'm showing you. Next up is the side slide. Number three on the die is side slide. So we roll a three, we're gonna do a side slide. One foot meets the other. You can change directions. You can also change the lead foot. That's fine. One foot might get tired as you're moving around but you can change the foot that leads. I'm changing directions regularly, making sure that I'm covering as much space as I can. Number four on the die will be a bear crawl. All fours down, crawling around, keep your core nice and tight. Your core is your belly, keep it nice and tucked in. Try and make sure that you are coordinating your arms and your legs as you are crawling around. Staying low, but at the same time moving and staying as strong as possible. Next coming up is bunny hops. Two-footed jump and two-footed land. Nice and under control. Make sure that when you land, it's a soft landing. You're bouncing or jumping off the balls of your feet, landing on the balls of your feet and absorbing all that energy into your body by soft landing. Number six on the die, if we roll it, will be a crab walk. You can move backwards, you can move forwards, you can move sideways. It's completely up to you. You can do this crab walk any way you want, as long as your bottom is off the ground. Unlike what I just did there, and if you haven't got the space, you can always hold the position on the floor for 30 seconds. So, six different exercises. We're going to do each one for 30 seconds. When we have the dice, we'll roll the dice. And if we get a one, we're going to do skipping. If we get a two, we'll do a gallop. If we do a three and roll a three, we'll do a side slide. If we roll a four, it will be a bear crawl. Five will be a bunny hop. And six will be a crab walk. Now each exercise, when we roll, we will do for 30 seconds and we will roll the die 20 times. So, are you ready? I'm ready, let's do this. Roll the die. Number six, crab walk. Here we go, 25 seconds to go, moving around. This one's difficult, 
You can go sideways, forwards, backwards. It's completely up to you where you travel or you can hold it in the same position. Whatever you want to do, that's fine. Nine seconds left. Mr. Clasby struggling. Keep it going. And we're done. Next roll. Four. Bear crawl. Let's go down. Start moving around. Stay low. Stay strong in the arms. Stay strong in the core. In the midsection where your belly is. Nearly there. Ten seconds to go. Keep moving. You can hold this one in the position, like in the middle as well. You don't actually have to move. You could stay in the middle. Next up, gallop. Let's go, Mr. Clasby. He's got his reins. He's moving around. Are you doing the same? <laughs> Ten seconds to go. Nearly there. Keep moving. Changing directions. Changing feet. And next roll is a five. That's a bunny hop. Get that bunny going. Eat a carrot. Oh, bunny wants to go the other way. Eat that carrot. There we go. Keep moving. Keep bouncing. Sideways bouncing there. Getting different ways of moving, doing zigzags now. As I said, you can travel any way you want as long as it's a bunny hop. Do you want to travel in a straight line, zigzag, or curve? Number two, gallop. Back to a gallop. Remember on a gallop, one foot leads the other. If you get tired, you can always change over to the other side. You can go a lot faster than I am. You can go as fast as you need to to get your level of fitness up. If you need to challenge yourself, go faster. If you need to slow down, you can as well. Uh, looks like I've stopped a little bit early there. What's the next dice? It's a skip. The good old skip. Make sure that your knees and your elbows are moving at the same time. You have that little hop in between. I've got a bit of space so I can move. If you can't move, stay on the spot. It's fine. The higher you jump, the harder it will be. Ten seconds remaining. I'm going backwards. I'm now going forwards. If you go backwards, make sure you look where you're going. Next die is a one again. If we get a double one or a double roll, we're going to do some running. So we're going to do some running on the spot for 20 or 30 seconds. Keep going, Mr. Clasby. So a double roll means that we do it for 30 seconds running on the spot. Let's get this boxing going as well. 10 seconds to go. Keep moving. Keep moving. And we're done. Next roll is a four. It's a bear crawl. Bear crawls are popular at the moment. Going sideways, mixing it up, changing it around. It doesn't have to be a bear crawl. It could be any animal you want it to. You can decide to be a lion, a tiger, a cat, meow, or a dog. Anything you want. And we're done. Two. Gallop. Get back into that horsey. Keep moving. A little bit faster, doing a canter now. Changing up the side that I'm leading with. Doing a zigzag pattern. Side slide a little bit. And we're done. Next is a four. Bear crawl. Back to the bear crawl. Going sideways, moving forwards, changing direction, staying low, keeping your core strong. Ten seconds to go. Rawr, rawr. 
Ah, uh, Mr. Clasby's given up. Never give up. Keep going. Four. It's running on the spot because we just rolled two fours in a row. Running on the spot. Get your arms going, knees going. Keep moving. 20 seconds to go. Keep it going. 10 seconds. Keep those legs pumping. And we're done. Next roll. Number four. So back to a bear crawl because we did three fours in a row. Bear crawl time. Rawr. 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 10 seconds to go. This bear's angry. This bear's working hard. And it's standing up on the back. There we are. We're done. Next roll's a three. Side slide. We haven't had one of these yet. This is good. Side slide. Moving, moving, changing direction. I'm changing the lead foot as I'm going around. I'm doing circles. I was doing zigzag earlier. Move around anyway. Have a little dance if you want. That's fine as well. But keep on moving. The main thing is that you keep on moving. Mr. Clasby, you stopped early there. Okay, let's have a go at galloping. Gallop, gallop, gallop. If you always use one leg, make sure you change over and use the other one. Make sure the other one is able to lead, that you're not just using the same one every time. Ten seconds to go. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, and we're rolling again. Running, because we just rolled two in a row. So instead of doing a gallop, we're going to do ro uh, we're going to do running on the spot. Get those knees going. Keep on moving. Good job. Keep on moving. There's nothing stopping you from doing this kind of activity using a dice, making up your own exercises when you want. Anytime. Rolling a four. It's a bear crawl. Oh, yes. Back to the bear crawl. So if you want to do this kind of exercise in the future, all you need is a dice or you need someone to tell you a number between one and six. If you do that, you can do this kind of exercise anytime and you can change the exercises from one to six. They don't have to be the same. It could be anything you want. Just a fun and different way to do exercise. Next roll. Bunny hop. Get that bunny hop going. Nice and soft landing. Keep moving all the time. There we go. Have a little clean. Eat your carrot. Keep moving. Have a little clean. Eat your carrot. Keep moving. Bouncing backwards now. And we're done. Skipping. Keep on moving. High knees. Doing diagonals. Doing on the spot. Doing sideways. Go the other side. Switch it up. Change it up. Make sure you're doing different things every time. Backwards. And this is our final roll. Our final roll is another one. So we're going to start doing some running. Running on the spot. 20 seconds left of this challenge. Keep moving. 10 seconds coming up. We're at 10 seconds. All right, turbo time. Keep moving. Even quicker. Turbo, turbo, turbo. Finish it off quick. Go, 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 go. And we're done. Great job, everyone. I need my rugby ball, the rugby ball of victory. We've completed it. Well done, everyone. Superb job. Give yourself a round of applause. You've done a fantastic job and a pat on the back. 
Don't forget the high fives. Excellent job. High five to the side. And now it's time for a cool down. High knees. Keep moving. Let your body recover. Get the arms going. You should be proud of yourself. You worked really hard there. Get your arms going a bit because we did crabs today. We did bear crawls. We did a lot of bear crawls. We should be the uh, masters of bear crawls. Do some side steps. Do a little dance if you want. It's up to you. As long as it's low intensity, low speed, you'll be okay. I'm doing a few leg swings here. Just trying to cool down. Fantastic effort today. Excellent work. Thank you so much for being part of this. And I'll see you next time.